Burble's Kikri. On a cold winter day Akbar and Burble took a walk along the lake. A thought came to Burble that a man would do anything for money. He expressed his feelings to Akbar. Akbar then put his finger into the lake and immediately removed it because he shivered with cold. Akbar said, I don't think a man would spend an entire night in the cold water of this lake for money. Burble replied, I am sure I can find such a person. Akbar then challenged Burble into finding such a person and said that he would reward the person with a thousand gold coins. Burble searched far and wide until he found a poor man who was desperate enough to accept the challenge. The poor man entered the lake and Akbar had guards posted near him to make sure that he really did as promised. The next morning the guards took the poor man to Akbar. Akbar asked the poor man if he had indeed spent the night in the lake. The poor man replied that he had. Akbar then asked the poor man how he managed to spend the night in the lake. The poor man replied that there was a street lamp nearby and he kept his attention affixed on the lamp and away from the cold. Akbar then said that there would be no reward as the poor man had survived the night in the lake by the warmth of the street lamp. The poor man went to Burble for help. The next day, Burble did not go to court. The king wondering where he was, sent a messenger to his home. The messenger came back saying that Burble would come once his kikri rice was cooked. The king waited hours but Burble did not come. Finally the king decided to go to Burble's house and see what he was up to. He found Burble sitting on the floor near some burning twigs in a bowl filled with kikri rice hanging five feet above the fire. The king and his attendants couldn't help but laugh. Akbar then said to Burble, how can the kikri rice be cooked if it's so far away from the fire? Burble answered, the same way the poor man received heat from a street lamp that was more than a furlong away. The king understood his mistake and gave the poor man his reward.